Welcome back, uh, dear viewers. As we said earlier that we are going uh, to talk about the performance of the Egyptian economy in 2016, the important economic decisions that were taken by the government and the package of economic reforms and its impact on Egyptian citizens. And to shed more light on this issue, we are joined here in the studio with Mr. Ambassador Mohammed al Husseini. He is the Economic Committee Director in the United Nations. Good morning, uh, Mr. Mohammed. Good morning, ma'am. Uh, Mr. Ambassador, um, today we want to talk about the 2016 economy, um, a kind of wrap-up of what happened uh, last year. So um, we need to know your estimation for what happened uh, in 2016 as a start. At the start, to uh, what happened in 2016, it was the first year since uh, June 1977 that Egypt faced its own problem. Because uh, basically uh, the previous governments have been coming the 70 years, it was actually look like we are taking a pain relievers, that we have the pain and we see the disease in our economy and we cannot face that. Why? Because we don't want the, 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 the citizen to face the hardship or even to come against the government. But uh, to, to return back to 2016, we got a new administration. This administration wanted to back to return Egypt to how it was since 60 or 50 years ago. So in the beginning, in 2016, uh, Egypt have delay in taking the decision of floating the bound because that's supposed to be done since two years ago. Because what happened in the country after the, the revolution in uh, 2011 and the revolution in, uh, in 2013, uh, what happened is uh, you have a lake and, uh, and the, the, the financial fund which is coming to the country come in, 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 the, in the less majors in the last 10 years. So when you talk about why we float the bound and, and some of the people, which they don't know in the economy, uh, the simple citizens that they ask and they say, we are facing a hard time now. Why did this happen? Where is the, the positive uh, uh, effective for those decisions? When, when it's come to the economy, the economy is a complicated cycle. This complicated cycle, cycle, when you take a decision, the decision, there is no positive and negative. There is a long run plan. Long run plan, all of us need to look positive. We don't need to look negative. Why? Because now we are fighting back and we are solving our problem. I will, I will simplize this, the, that uh, thing as when you go to a doctor, a surgery doctor, and you have a, a strong disease. Uh, this disease, you are taking a medication since 20 years and there is nothing has happened. So the doctor told you that he need to cut the disease part and then he will connect your body again. This is exactly what's happening in our economy. Because the first thing you take when, when you said, okay, I have a lack of fund, uh, the, 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 the foreign currency in, uh, in Egypt in the last three years come to the less majors in the, in, in the last 20 years. And that because of the uh, tourists is not in, in, the same, in, in the same income how it was before. Because of course, you are uh, against war in the country and outside the country. And the second thing is the importing and the exporting gap. We have, we are importing 80% of our goods that there is no country, there is no uprising country with a strong economy importing 80% of, it, of its goods unless they are exporting 70 or 75 percent look like Singapore Singapore is is importing 92 percent of them goods but they are exporting 95 percent to the worldwide but you are importing 80 percent and you are exporting something like 20 percent of your goods and some of the, and the some of these goods you are uh, you are exporting the the, the 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 raw material and this is a disaster so when you when you consider it like that that there is a, the foreign currency coming or the dollar let's say it like that by the first thing is the, the egypt the tourist this is already fall number two the export it's already it's not and and you have a war even in the 20 percent abroad and the third thing the the huge gap happened in the importing the goods which are the necessary and the unnecessary and the fourth thing is 
Suez Canal uh, uh, income have been also less, not because of Suez Canal, because of the, 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 international, the, the international trade have been go in 30.5%. Which, when you when you when you combine all of that, meaning that the, the, the out resources to the country for the foreign currency come down, so you cannot say that the pound is eight, that the dollar is is eight point five pound. No, the, the the actual price is thirteen. So this is that was the first decision. That decision is supposed to be promoted. What we didn't do. What we do is we did the decision late in November 3rd. You suppose before you do the decision when it's come to the economy, you put three plans. The first plan is what will be the effective of this to the, to the simple citizen and the second thing to the investors, how you can seek the direct and the indirect investors to the country. And the third thing, what will be your plan for the long run to uh, making a stabilization to, to your market? So based on that, what happened is uh, and the, the, the government made the, the order of floating the pound and we didn't promote it in the right way. And we, 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 we take it at the fall floating under the base of the demand and supply to the banks. The, the, the only good thing is we killed the black market because the black market, it was look like you, you, you are in two lines, the economy of the country and the black market. And the black market was, was eating the goods, was controlling everything in the country. And the only one who was suffering from that was the simple citizen. So what you are facing now, you are facing after you make the, 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 the floating of the pound, you already uh, remove the fuel subsidies and that cause for you uprising to the prices for all the goods. Yeah, we are facing a hard time in 2016 and it will come more harder in 2017. Yeah, this, so this is, this is, is my what coming I can, question to yeah. you and your, your expectations for the year 2017 uh, on the economic front. Uh, actually, uh, uh, when, 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 we, when we look to 2017, we first, uh, as, as what we talk in 2016, the, the orders and the decision have been done. Yes. The VAT, the VAT which the, 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 the new tax have been done and uh, removing the fuel subsidies. Uh, not removal, yani, uh, let's say we already cut it in a steps, and then number three, uh, floating the pound. Number four, uh, we, we also uh, did uh, to the IMF, we, we have, yes. we, they are looking to us now with a different clock because we are not looking, talking about the loan here because the loan will go direct to, uh, to the development in the country in the poor uh, destinations look like the villages and, and, and places like that and also to support the fuel. Yes. So when you come like that, the IMF, uh, we apply for that loan since two or three years ago. Now, when they saw you at the government, you are already moving forward for that. They already approve and they already sent for you 2.3 billion dollar. So based on that, we are already moving. In 2017, we will face this decision on the ground. How? Now, the simple citizens, they are uh, complaining about uprising the prices and uh, you cannot uprise the salaries because the institutions, or sorry, the establishments or the companies or even the government firms, they have looked like a, a major standard system in, 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 in uprising the salaries, you know, by an, an annual increase or a half annual increase. And uh, uh, what's happening in the country affecting now the investors, the local investors, not the foreign investors, because the local investors have uh, take a plan in the last 10 to 15 years in importing everything. Now, you don't have other because the government have put a decision in March uh, in, uh, in, in uprising the custom fees because now they don't want you to import everything. They want you to, 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 to work. Mm. So the factories in the country uh, have, 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 have make a lot of requests saying we have a problem when it's come to the gas and the fuel and the electricity. The government, uh, the, the, the industrial union chambers have, have, have made a statement before three months ago that the government have already and the Minister of Trade and Industry have already decided to uh, lower the prices to the factories and support those de de the debits to the banks and the financial debts they have it in the last four years so doing that it, it will it will reverse the cycle of production to the country it means 
that now we can compete when it's come to the, exp the, the, the exporting. And then the second thing, in, 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 in giving to the market the Egyptian products. This is the only way for us to not to make the simple citizen suffer. Because if you are taking that good, you are importing that from China, it was, causing, it was costing you before something like pound. Now it's costing you a hundred pound. But you can't take it in the, in the Egypt local market with a ten pound. So to the simple citizen, or we are talking about 75% of the population in Egypt, will go to this market. But you cannot do that like that. This is the only problem we are facing in Egypt because we have two uh, councils or committees is not working in Egypt. They don't have an effective. The first one is the consumer protection. Consumer protection, the, the first, the first uh, uh, major of them objects as, 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 a, as, a, as a council, uh, they must go uh, uh, and make a plan and control the markets. You cannot leave the market to the trade. The trader, he wants to gain a profit. He don't care what, okay, you don't have money, so don't come to me. But there must be a, a powerful movement from the consumer protection to, to, to find these prices. The prices now is rising up to 300%. You can imagine that. And some goods, of course, the imported one. And the second thing, you need to put the international standard and the quality uh, in the, the, the manufacturer for the Egyptian goods, they have made a, 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 a new trend, and I, I, I volunteer in that, which is made in Egypt, made in Egypt slogan, that you are already putting a standards to the factories, you need to follow these standards to compete the uh, uh, out uh, uh, the worldwide standards for the for the goods so coming uh, to to your question about the expectation to 2017 you can say that the, the, the first six months of 2017 is what's happening now what you are facing now as a we simple continue. citizen we will continue that up to june 2017 but there is will not be more uh, economic orders or decisions more increase in the prices? No, the, the, prices can, the, price, the prices now, it's look like to the dollar, it's coming the demand and supply. Yes. But what the government is doing now is they are cutting the resources to take these prices. Mm. The prices now is already high, it cannot yes. be more higher than that, it uh, cannot. Yeah. And the dollar cannot be more higher than that. The dollar now, uh, after we received the second scale of the, of the loan and after supporting our, our industry this is this is what we need to move the government yes. need to move in that yes. because based of based of supporting your industry the industry is the is the backbone to the economy this is the only salvation for us to return prices to the normal measurement and to lower the and to lower the, the prices price, of, of course. course but the second half of two, 2017 you will find already a kind of stability yes a kind of stability in the economy why because the, 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 the control of all of this cycle mm. is the, the foreign currency, mm. nothing else. So but sir, um, uh, of course, the, the, uh, the economic measures that, that were taken, uh, it's for the uh, public uh, benefit, but uh, the middle class uh, are already suffering. Yeah. So when the middle class are suffering, what about the low income brackets? Okay, let's, this is a, a good question because uh, actually uh, the, the middle class is suffering, why? Because the income to them is the same, mm -hmm. right? And uh, the, let's, let's, let's put it like that, those who, who, who they don't have a stable income, and this is a big scale in our community, what you will do to them? The administration in the country is already facing the hard, hard, hard chip that no president can face what President Abfateh Aziz is facing. Nobody's supporting him. I'm talking about worldwide. Before, uh, when, 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 you're, when your voice is not coming up or uprising, everyone is giving you donation and support. Now, when you return back Egypt the decision in the international firm, there is, there is a brothers and, and there is neighbors is, is coming against your decision because it's already coming not in a crossing to them policy. So your president is working alone. The only trust he has for the Egyptian people and the Egyptian people already give him this trust and they are already carrying with him in this particular time. When you come now, to those in needs, because those they don't have a stable income, 
what we what we need to do at the government here in Egypt is the first thing that the army have make uh, something like uh, this uh, for 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 the consumer units yes. to distribute the goods in a low prices and this is in everywhere in the country uh, when you look to when you look to this uh, not to the mid class i will talk about the lower class T to them the only, the only Actually, important... sir, we need to know more about what you're saying, but we ran out of time. Yeah, and, uh, Ambassador uh, Mohammed Al Husseini, Economic Committee Director uh, at the UN, thank you very much for joining us. My pleasure, ma'am. Welcome once again to breakfast. My job. pleasure, ma'am. My pleasure. Thank, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Mohammed. And now, uh, uh, dear viewers, uh, we'll, see you, we'll see you tomorrow with the new, co uh, with the new crew, and I'd like to thank my colleague, Dina. Thank you, Shireen. Thank you so much. And... Uh,